What is up, everybody? Welcome to Toys, Toys Boom. Uh, my name is Nacho, and I'm here with... Pirate Penny, our me mateys. That is right, and today uh, we are super excited because, you know what? It's time for Mario. That's right, the Super Mario Bros. movie. I don't know how many of you guys saw this. I don't know uh, if you did. It was a pretty big movie, pretty awesome movie. But uh, as of right now, uh, it is coming out tomorrow or tonight at 12. Uh, you will be able to get it on digital, which is super exciting. I know we're going to download it right away mm -hmm. so that we can watch it. Super excited. And uh, in preparation for it, we thought, hey, why not pick up the Monopoly version of the Super Mario Bros. movie and check it out, see what it's all about. We love uh, Super Mario um, and we love Monopoly, big Monopoly fans. Pirate Penny, tell us about how much you love Monopoly. I love Monopoly so much. Now, I don't know if you guys remember, but we played the Game of Life Mario edition. And I see that these coins are pretty similar to it. And it, I don't know. I love Monopoly. I've loved the original. We have some other types of Monopolies. But I'm excited to, to get in. That's right. We are obviously big Monopoly fans here. We also have Monopoly Gamer version here of, um, of of Monopoly with Mario, which is a super fun version of it. Um, and, you know, it's a little bit of a different gameplay. You can play a little bit different. You're trying to beat Bowser. You've got coins, uh, which is super exciting. And so, you know, we'll see today uh, what this new one is like. It looks quite similar to the gamer version. So, um, yeah, I think, I think Pirate Penny, maybe now is the time to open it up, yeah. unbox it, See what we're dealing with here. Should I have my scissors? Yep, your pirate penny scissors. Yep. <laughs> I'll get it. You'll get there. Oh, don't do that. So I got one side. Let's see if I can get it open by... No, it's all on four sides. Ooh. Who's your favorite character in the Mario movie? Um, in the, oh, in the Mario movie specifically. specifically. Uh, I have to go Bowser. I mean, Jack Black as Bowser. Peaches, 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 peaches. So good. Yeah. I mean, I love it. Uh, who was your favorite character? Toad. Toad? I liked Toad. Toad was, was funny. Fun. He was fun. Keegan Michael Key playing that part. He was awesome. Got all four sides. All right. Here we go. Now opening the box, and what's in here? Okay. Oh. oh try not what? To this up. Look at this. This is fun. I can just want to stay up. Sorry, Maybe, guys. It was just a, yeah, a bit further back there. That's good. There we go. Oh, I wonder what that could be. All right, so we've got... We've got uh, the little box Super here. Super cool picture here. Got the... Uh, cards, probably the chance in the community chest or whatever they're going to call it. These are Bow Bowser's Fury Ooh. and Question Block and oh, Game Over. I wonder what that means. Oh, huh. interesting. What's on the other side of those? I don't know. Oh, wait. Is that oh, the... Oh, it's the... the uh, Cards. Yeah, I see. It's like if you have to mortgage. Gotcha. Oh, here's That's the big funny. Bowser. Okay, there's the big Bowser right there. We'll go ahead and get him out of his cage there. He's now free. Get to do the lucky Bowser. That's pretty push cool. Push all these coins out. It's really cool. Oh, getting all the coins out. All right, so while we're doing that, I'm going to go ahead and open this up. I wonder what that I'm is. I'm assuming this has Ooh. the pieces and the dice. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's go ahead and pull out one by one. Okay. Oh, that's, yep. That's what a little that? uh, mushroom. Oh, okay. A little mushroom right there. Set that down. I guess we didn't look at what the characters could be. We've got Mario's hat right here. Oh, well, that's right cool. There. Yeah, they're all these kind of like gray pieces, which... Plastic? Yeah, they're plastic gray pieces, which I, it's kind of in the Monopoly uh, uh, vibe. I, I miss the whole metal pieces, yeah. but that's fine. Uh, this is Luigi's flashlight from Luigi's Mansion. Uh, then it looks like we have Princess Peach's uh, crown here. 
Um, and then this is Toad's um, pan. pan. So uh, very much like the figures of old. Oh, this oh, this is actually really cool. I like that dice. Ooh, that's cool. Black and red, it's kind of shiny. Like that, you can see that right there. Yeah. And then the red and white for uh, Mario. Pretty cool. So it's like they're battling. And then the stand for our friend Bowser right here. Oh. So we'll put Bowser on the stand so that he's standing right there just like that. Very cool. You know, this is sort of fun. <laughs> Getting all the coins out of here. But... Miss the good old money, but I get it. Coins make sense for Mario. Absolutely. All right. Let's see if I can get these off here. I'm going to go ahead and get the board going here. Bum, bum, bum. All right, let's take a look at this board. Ooh. Very nice. Yep. 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 Monopoly boards. Tricky, Come on, tricky. Nacho. You can do it. Nacho. All right. So I'll try to show you guys a close-up of this board and what we're dealing with here. We've got uh, Go, so you can collect two coins or a two coin, a coin that has a number two on it, or just two coins. Two nope. coins. You're just collecting two coins. Then the next thing, because this is um, Mario, Super Mario Bros. movie Monopoly, so this is going to be Brooklyn, um, uh, obviously where they're from. Oh, then you got Bowser's, Bowser's Fury. You got to pull a card, one of Bowser's Fury. You got Brooklyn Heights. Then you got a warp pipe. That's super fun Ooh, in fun. place of the trains. Uh, then the next thing you can buy is Warp Zone. That's cool. That's where they went to the, the new land. Um, question Block. That'll be fun. Snow Kingdom. Oh, yeah. That was the first, um, the penguins who fought Bowser's army. Oh, yeah. That was fun. I'm always surprised that they Spoiler never alert. changed. Hopefully you saw the movie. <laughs> yeah. I'm always surprised that they never changed the in jail look because it feels like you could have done something from the movie, like, a, oh, like those, the dungeon that the they were in. Maybe things. like the little stars yeah, in there. Yeah. You know, that would have been cool. Hey, I don't know. Just throwing out ideas. You should be a Monopoly maker. Yeah. Next time. Next time. Uh, high Cliffs here. Then you've got Superstar, Waterfall area, another uh, warp pipe, uh, desert area, which... The desert areas, when I'm playing Monopoly, those are always my favorite um, areas to play. Oh, those I love are those. always so hard. Bowser's Fury again, then Rainbow Road with the awesome go-kart scene, free parking. It would have been cool to have like a, like a Donkey Kong cart or something on there, or any one of the carts, really. Mm -hmm. All right, then we've got Dark Lands here. Uh, oh, yeah, that's that awesome scene where they chase them. Mm -hmm. Another question block, Bowser's Castle. Wow, Bowser's Castle already. Okay. Uh, Warp Pipe. Uh, Fire Flower Fields, Bowser's Fury again, Jungle Kingdom where Donkey Kong lives, fantastic. Then there's the go to jail, obviously. Mushroom Forest, right over here. Uh, and then you've got the question block again. Mushroom Kingdom, more pipe. Mushroom Heights, we're getting to the end, so this is your park place. You got a piranha plant here, we got a roll and pay. And then you've got Peach's Castle as your boardwalk to finish it off. So now we'll lay the board out just like so. Just like that. We'll go ahead and put Bowser's Fury over here where it goes. Um, and Bowser, I would assume, goes somewhere on the board if this isn't Yeah, he like, goes up there in the corner a little bit. Like right here? Okay. Yeah. Uh, so it says, dive into the world of Super Mario. I'm reading the directions sure. if you were wondering. Yes. Okay. Uh, properties on the board are lo locations from the Super Mario Bros. movie. And railroads are warp pipes. Team up to battle Bowser. The Bowser token starts the game on free parking. On your turn, you'll use the black die to move Bowser and then both dice to move your token. If you pass Bowser, do nothing. If oh, interesting. If Bowser passes you, pay one coin to the bank. If you ever find yourself on the same space as Bowser, you and a friend will have to roll the dice to battle him, lose, and you'll go directly to jail. Oh, wow. That's interesting. So that's way different. Okay. Yeah. Kind of confusing. Okay, so you start off with Bowser here. He All starts right. on free parking. Oh, he starts over here. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so who do you want to be? Which, which one would you want to be? Princess Peach? Of course. All right, and I'll be the Mario Cap, because why not? Uh, so, so... Um, why don't you go first, Pirate Penny? Okay. This also says locations can be set to game over mode. When Bowser lands on a location, it is set to game over mode. In order to collect rent, the owner must pay 
the continued costs on their title deed card to the bank. Um, I really actually like how they switch up the rules. I think that's a lot of fun. I think it's it, it adds like a, a different wrinkle to the Monopoly game. Because obviously Monopoly is fairly, you know, it's straightforward. You're trying to get all the properties. But then when you throw something like this in, you know, you throw in your wild card over here of, of Bowser and it's it's it adds this new wrinkle to right. it and really makes the uh, the game come alive. I have to hand out the correct coins. Are we playing a whole game or are we just showing them the gist of the game? Uh, I think we should play a couple rounds. Okay. Yeah, let's see how it rolls. So, let's see. Trying to find out how many coins each person gets. So sorry, bear with me. Um, let's see. How to win? Who goes first? On your turn. Banker gives each player five pennies or five one points. Which, oops, one two. Three, four, five. One, two. And then five, five, belt, five. Fivers. <laughs> five fibers. And then, let's see. Place the Bowser on the free parking space. Shuffle the. The Bowser Fury card, shuffle the question block card. Okay. Put the dice by the game board. Uh, one, if you have any properties, you may pay. Roll both dice. So when do you roll the dice to see where Bowser goes? Don't you do that first? So, example. So this is five. So Bowser moves five. Okay. And I move six. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I got a question block. All right, let's see what your question block says. Question block, keep this card until you're ready to use it. Let's go, put your Tanuki suit and, uh, put on your Tanuki suit and fly away. Trade any one of your properties for any one of another player's properties. You may not trade properties that are part of a complete set. All right, so. So did Bowser land on a location? He did. Then that location goes into game over mode. Interesting. What location did he land on? It was the Fire Flower Fields. Okay, so fire. we're just going to put that by it. Okay. It says, so did Bowser land on a location? It goes into game over mode. See Bowser. Uh, there's a lot of... <laughs> there's a, lot, there's of a lot of little different rules here, yeah. yeah. So... Where did Bowser land? When Bowser lands on an owned location, that location is now in game over mode. Okay. So it's not owned. So it wasn't owned. The owner must flip the location title deed face down. No player may collect it. When Bowser lands on an unowned location, that location is now in game over mode. Oh. Flip that location title deed face down. That location can still be purchased or auctioned, but the new owner must continue, continue it before they can collect rent. Wow. So, and then, so if you were to land on Bowser, like on the same space he's on, you have to battle him. If he lands on a space that somebody else is already on, that person own, gives him a coin, or you have to get rid of a coin. That's a lot. All right. So now it's your turn. Nacho. Okay, so... I thought it said that you roll both of the you dice. You rolled both. Okay. And so whatever this the one is. The black is him. I got you. One, two, three. So he goes to jail. Verse. Yeah, he's just on the spot. Or does he just stay? He okay. just stays there. So and then I go three. And so I've landed on... Oh, I should have been right here. Oh, this isn't a player. Yeah. I'm sorry. Brooklyn Heights. So I get I can buy Brooklyn Heights now correct. for probably one. Uh, Correct. For one. Okay, there we go. Put that in the bank. And now I've got Brooklyn Heights. Maybe he goes to jail, because that Which makes sense. Does it say? If he lands, does he is he playing the game like, like everyone else is, I guess, is the question. To continue location in a game over mode. Blah, blah, blah. Did Bowser land on your space, or did you land on his? 
That doesn't really say. I would say Always he's... move Bowser according to the black die. Always move Bowser first, then move your own token. Yeah. I feel like he's... Exempt from jail. Yeah, he's just kind of running his own game. Which technically... Yeah, that's fine. We'll just leave it that way. If you think he should go to jail, let us know. Yeah. <laughs> I, I feel fine with, like, kind of, he's kind of like running the board. I kind of like that. All right, so we've got... Bowser's going to move three now. Yep. One, two, three. So okay. he's on Mushroom Kingdom? Yep. And then I move six. Warp pipe. I don't know what to do on a warp pipe. Can I warp wherever I want? Yeah, what does it say? Let's see. Because obviously when it's, you know, normal Monopoly... Um... Warp pipe. Move to the next warp pipe and stop there. If you pass go, collect two coins from the bank. So does that mean I I just work to this one? Yeah. Over here? I did not pass go. All right. All right. Now it's Nacho's turn. All right. Here we go. Uh, Let's see yeah, what happens. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Brooklyn. All right. And then uh, I'm going to move three. One, two, three. Oh, wait. You own Brooklyn. So now... No, I own this one. Oh, I'm sorry. I gave you the wrong one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, question mark. Okay, I've got a question. I've landed on the question block. So it says, Oh, no. Toad has fallen behind. It's not easy having tiny legs. I would say it would have been cool to have, like, a picture of Toad on there. Yeah. Just for funsies. But still, it's fine. Or, fun. like, you know, mine could have had, like, the Tanuki suit. Yeah. Oh, that would have been cool. Mm -hmm. So, that's okay. You know, you know hey, you didn't you, I can board. imagine Toad in my mind. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Toad has fallen behind. It's not easy having to go back three spaces. Okay, one, two, three, which is a property that I own. So that was that was that was easy. Okay. If you own two properties, you can double the rent for those locations. Because notice, we don't put any castles or anything on these. Oh wow! So you just double. The so you rent. just say you double the rent, right? Yeah. Which is so much. You know, that's such a big part of the game is putting more hotels and, and houses on there. My, th I th I'm pretty sure, I mean, the whole point of this game is just to beat Bowser, right? Yes. Yeah, okay. Ooh, he's probably gonna pass you. So, one, two, three. But he didn't land on you. Right. He passed you, so you owe him a coin, right? I do, is that what it says? I shall pay him a coin. Did Bowser pass any players? They must pay one coin to the bank. There you go, bank. Take my coin. All right. This is kind of fun. I like this. Uh, and then I move five. Would you five mind spaces, moving yes. me five? One, two, three, four, oh, five. Oh, that was a close one. Mushroom Forest. How many? Four. Four wow. coins. Woo. Expensive. I mean, it's the whole Mushroom Forest. I would expect to pay something for it. All right. Here we go. We're going to roll all right, that's four for Six. Bowser. Oh, sorry, four. You're right. One, two, three, four. He's just visiting jail. And ah. <laughs> Mario moves six. One. Oops, so sorry. One, two, three, four, five, six. You, you passed him, but he didn't pass you. Right, so I'm all, I'm all good. Uh, How much is that? Two? Yeah, High Cliffs is two. I shall buy High Cliffs for two. The price of two coins. Oops, sorry. There we go. Yeah, there. All right, Fantastic. my turn. There's high cliffs, a nice, nice close-up view. Why am of, I not seeing uh, the? Oh, that was, that was crazy, guys. I couldn't find the diary because it's red. <laughs> I blended it's, in. Yeah, it's sorry, in. guys. Okay, four for Bowser. One, two, three, four. So he passed you again. So he, <laughs> you. Oh wow! Lost another coin. I'm, I've really got to get ahead of Bowser. And then, I have six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Have you did you you didn't pass go yet? No, I've not passed go. I'm going to buy Peach's castle. Oh, look at that. The boardwalk of this game. Pirate and Peach, Penny. Peach Peach's Castle. Pirate Penny, you've wow. really Really you've done really it. shocked you everyone. Know? Everyone's shocked by you. I'm gonna really try to give it. you guys a better more of angle. an overhead view of what we're dealing with here. I wonder what happens if you here get a Bowser's go. Fury card. Oh, this is a much better view. Sorry, everyone. I should have started there. It's okay. It's all right. It is now your turn. Okay. <laughs> I will roll. Here we go. Uh, five for Bowser. One, two, three, four, five. 
and I'm going to move one. And I've landed on super, a super star. star. Roll plus co collect. So you roll. Oh, nice. Do I roll both dice? Roll the red die. Oh, just the red one. Okay. And collect that many coins. Six. Nice. Nice. Look at you. That's fun. Got your money back. That's what it's all about right there. Four for Bowser and one for me. Fire flower, whatever. Okay. And I get two coins for, I wonder if, I wish I had got more for landing on go. It's fine. All right, it's your turn now. My turn again, here we go. Roll, and Bowser's gonna move six. One, two, three, four, five, six. He's catching up. And me. I'm gonna move three. One, two, and three. Oh, you get to own the one you the want. The desert, yes. That's fantastic. And the desert costs you two. Here we go. I've got a five, mm. a fiver there. So I'll go ahead and do that. And then I'll show you guys the desert area right here. This is what I just purchased. Um, yeah. One of my favorite areas to visit while playing Mario. You own so many already. I especially enjoyed it um, while uh, playing Super Mario Odyssey. It was fantastic. Oh, that's such a good game. Yeah. So these are all the ones that, that Nacho is got right now. Pirate Penny one. only has two. How yeah. sad. Maybe you'll get another one right here. Four. One, two, three, four. Oof. Okay, so... He landed on mine. Now he's landed on your property. So when he lands on it... So, when Bowser lands on an owned location, that location is now in game over mode. The owner must flip the location's title deed face down, so like this. No player may collect rent on a location in game over mode. To continue a, lo a location in game over mode, pay the bank the continue. So I have to pay to get it back. Wow. Any of these that you land on, you have to pay to get them yeah, back. Yeah, this is kind of cool. It's crazy. So now, Pirate Penny, tell us how one would win the game. What's, what, what is the, the, how do you win? Because I know in Mario Gamer, you've actually got to try to take out Bowser. Right. So how, how do you win this version of, of Monopoly, the Super Mario Bros. movie version of Monopoly? It says, did Bowser land on your space or did land on his battle him? Choose another player to team up with. No, if Bowser lands on a space that is occupied by you and and two or more other players, each of those other players must roll a dice. The highest roller then teams up with you to battle Bowser. You and your teammates each roll one of the dice. If you if your combined roll is seven or higher, you defeat Bowser. Do the following. You and your teammate each collect two coins from the bank. Place Bowser on go. He must stay there until all players have completed their next turn. Then Bowser rejoins the game and players resume moving him according to the number shown on the black die. So, like, you battle him and you win, but then the game's not over? How do you win? I guess whoever has the most coins wins. Yeah, when 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 does when do you win? I don't know. I'm trying to find that. Whose turn is it now? It's your turn. It's my turn. I have okay. to still move mine four. And you gotta move four. Nope, you gotta move six. I'm sorry. Yes. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, question block. Question block. Let's see what it says. Mario and Luigi finish a job. Time to get yeah. paid. Collect. Definitely, it would be awesome to have a picture of them right there. Just saying. Am I too I high? Guess I'll, I'm sorry. I should stop saying. That. Collect one from each player. Okay. Hey. You want a coin? I'll give you one coin. Thank you for completing the job. Thank you. Appreciate it. For your All business. Right. Here we go. I'll keep reading to see who, how you win. Uh, so Bowser's going to move four. One, two, three, four. And I own that. So now that's a game over for me. You're right. Nice. Okay. And now I'm going to move four. four spaces. One, two, three, four. Dark lands, which is three, so I'll give the bank a five and I'll get two back. You can buy, sell, or trade locations with other players at any time. Locations can be traded for coins, other locations, and or get out of jail free cards. The amount is decided by the players. Sorry, I'm not even in there. Um, 
Because I guess you're you want to have the most coins. I think that's how you win. Yeah. So okay. So is it whenever someone runs out of coins? Yeah, I'm thinking so. Like maybe when the first one bankrupts. Right. It doesn't like say. I'm trying to find like where it says where you win. Yeah, normally these games or these, uh, the, the instruction manuals have a clear like, hey, this is how you win. This is when there's a, a player that says you've won. How to win. Oh, there we go. <laughs> okay, so show them where that was. <laughs> On the top. It says it right there. How to win. It's Move fine. around the board. <laughs> We've seen it now. <laughs> Buying as many properties as you can. The more properties you own, the more rent you'll be able to collect from all from other players. If you're the last player with coins when all other players have gone bankrupt, you win. Awesome. Okay, so I, I think having played a couple rounds, I'm, I'm kind of getting a feel for this. Mm -hmm. And I would, I would love to just say, like, I actually really like this version. I think the, the super fun part is, is that you get to do, you get to move uh, Bowser every time you move. Right. And so there's multiple actions happening and so it's it's actually makes the game of Monopoly a bit more exciting, especially I would say for uh, for kids, yeah, um, for younger kids because because there's so much happening, mm -hmm. and obviously you've got all the super fun um, Mario movie stuff going on and all the locations, mm -hmm. uh, but moving this guy around and how he's kind of chasing um, chasing you and he can land on you and all this kind of stuff, it's kind of like you're constantly fighting Bowser, mm -hmm. which is which is really cool. Um, so. I think there's, you know, there's a couple things. Like, I would love to see pictures um, on, like, the question cards. And and there's all the, also some other, so, like, we haven't, no one landed on a piranha plant. Which yeah. piranha plant is actually your roll and It's like pay. the reverse of the star. Yeah. And so, like, you've got Bowser's Fury. And so this one's, like, Bowser's airship is guarded by Koopas and Goombas. There's no way to enter advance to just visiting. If you pass go, do not collect to... Bowser's Fury, the Shy Guys. Hey, there's a picture on this one. Mm -hmm. Well, look at that. The Shy Guys sneak up on you. You're captured and brought to Bowser's dungeon. So this one got a picture. Well, I found one with a picture. Strange. Just kind of randomly, they're they're choosing to have pictures. Jump in a cart and race back to the Mushroom Kingdom before Bowser arrives. Advance to go. Collect two. Interesting. But yeah, no, it's... This is a really fun version. Having, you know, we have multiple versions of Monopoly, and this one is is honestly right up there. It's super fun. It's a lot like Gamer mm -hmm. uh, with the same coin system, which is yeah. super cool. Um, and then, you know, if you do love the Super Mario Bros. movie, which we do, then it's a it's a fantastic one to add to uh, your collection. Yeah. Um, so overall, I would say, like, yeah, if you love the Mario Bros. movie and you love Monopoly, like, this is, this is the perfect pairing for you. Um, so yeah, thanks so much everybody for watching. Pirate Penny, any last final thoughts on this awesome Super Mario Bros. movie Monopoly? Yeah, I think it's really fun. I think I think uh, having Bowser on there adds more to the game. And I think once you get the rules, it's a little bit easier to understand the game. It's yeah. a little confusing at first, but then once you start playing it, it makes sense. It could be a lot of fun. Yeah. Um, and I really, I, I love Monopoly. So. I, I think probably one of the highlights is this awesome black and red die here. Bowser's die. Like, that's really cool. Yeah. Really cool. All right. So, I mean, I think, uh, yeah, if you like Monopoly, if you like Super Mario Bros. movie, and if you want, like, a new twist mm -hmm. on the Monopoly game, I think this is the way to go. It's a really cool set to add to your collection. I'm super happy that we got it. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, thanks so much, everybody, for watching Toys, Toys, Boom. Uh, my name's Nacho. That's Pirate Penny. Arrgh! <laughs> TTB, out! out.